What's up guys, welcome to Superwise, I'm John and I just finished watching Denis Villeneuve's Dune and wow, um, time for controversy because a lot of people are hyping this up saying it's great, it's a masterpiece, it's amazing, it's phenomenal. Me, I didn't hate it, but I didn't love it. I don't think it's that great, honestly. I think it's decent. Now let's quickly get the good out of the way because this movie isn't all bad. There's actually great stuff in it. Like Denis Villeneuve as a director. He's a fantastic director. Prisoners is one of my favorite movies of all time. Blade Runner 2049, really enjoyed that film. And the shots here, oh my God, they're amazing. The cinematography is beautiful easily the best part of the movie is the cinematography the shots the vision the cgi and special effects also really really good it just has this grand epic scope and it's just visually stunning then we have the acting and the acting overall is really good the standouts are rebecca ferguson oscar isaac he's really good in this movie and javier bardem and when it comes to Th Timothy Chalamet as the lead, I think he's a good actor, not a great actor. Some of the line delivery from him, it gets pretty cringe, to be honest with you. And But but he's good. He's, he's good. He's just not great. Now let's get into why I didn't really love this movie. And it's just the execution of the story. I thought... It was really slow paced and I can take slow paced movies, but the action scenes here are few and far between and the story, the plot has to be engaging enough to where I can tolerate the slow burn. But for me, this was just a slow burn all the way through with a couple of action scenes that didn't really even blow me away. The action scene at the end, I'm not going to spoil it. There was a fight scene at the end that was kind of cool, I guess, but it didn't impress me i guess th th my point about this review this movie did not impress me i thought it was fine i watched it now i'm gonna move on because i just there's no rewatchability to it it's too long it's too slow paced i just and i have the same problem with blade runner 2049 i really like the movie but it's just hard to rewatch because it's so long and just it takes uh a while to get to where we need to get to but with prisoners the slow burn works because it's a crime th thriller we're trying to figure out the mystery blade runner 2049 even that the slow burn works because we're trying to figure out you know ryan gosling's character and where's harrison ford and stuff like that but here it's just it's it it gets uninteresting and even worse i'm not invested in any of these characters there's i don't like any of them None of them stood out. I didn't care about any of them. Like Timothy Chal Chalamet's Paul, like he's kind of an interesting character, but I just, like if he died in battle, I wouldn't care. If any of them died, I wouldn't care. This movie didn't give me one reason why I should care for these characters. You know, you ha you're we're following the protagonist. We have to like the protagonist, and I just don't. And that's the issue. I'm not invested in this universe. When we get a part two, and we will, I'm honestly not going to rush out to see this because I'm not, I just don't care about the universe. I, I, I don't care about anybody. That's the issue. I'm not invested. I just don't know that Denis Villeneuve was the right choice for this movie. Again, the movie is beautiful, but there's no real energy or pizzazz to it. I feel like if you got someone like James Wan, you, he could provide the necessary energy and flair. Like, I'll take Prisoners over this. I'll take Blade Runner 2049 over this. And then to add to it, Denis was trashing the MCU movies. And I have a lot of respect for Denis, great director. But he was trashing the MCU movies, saying that whoever watched them would turn into a zombies and that they were mind-numbing and, you know, the typical you know, generic artiste director complain about the MCU. But I'll tell you this, after seeing this movie, when you walk out of an MCU movie, you're invested in these characters and the universe and you want to see more. With Dune, I cannot tell you one character that I liked and that I was invested in. I'm not invested in this universe. So Denis, you know, should hold off judgment 
he's of course entitled to his opinion, but still, you know, he shouldn't be so harsh on the MCU after making this film. But, you know, overall, the, those are my thoughts on Dune. Just a quick review. Just wanted to get it out there because I see a lot of overhype about it, saying it's, it's a masterpiece and whatever. Definitely disagree. It has its issues, and it's not Denis' best film, and it was just... It, it wasn't as, as quality as I wanted it to be. So, yeah. It, it was fine, but not great, and it didn't impress me. But those are my thoughts. Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. What do you think about Dune? Do you agree with my complaints or do you love this movie? Let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. I loved Hans Zimmer's music and the movie was beautiful, but that's about it. So let me know your thoughts in the comments down below. Please remember to like, share, comment, and subscribe. That will be all for me. And remember my catchphrase, guys. Stay super wise. <laughs>